In this video, you will learn the way to simply backup Oracle database with Vinchin Backup and Recovery in three steps. You can use the software to protect Oracle Standalone or Oracle Rack 11G, 12C, 18C, 19C, 20C, 21C in both physical and virtual machines. First, let's open and log in Vinchin Backup Server Web Console. Go to Database Backup Backup page to create a backup job. Step 1. Select an Oracle database to backup. You will see all licensed databases you have added to Vinchin Backup System here. Select the Oracle database that you would like to backup. After it appears in the right area, click Next. Step 2. Choose a backup destination. Just select a target node and target storage for the database backup file and click Next. Step 3. Set up backup strategies in details. With Vinchin Backup and Recovery, you can have many features that help set up a preferred Oracle backup plan. You can choose either once-off backup or backup as scheduled as the backup mode. Once-off backup will trigger a full backup only once. Backup as scheduled will trigger regular Oracle database backups and more backup strategies including incremental backup, differential backup, and archive log backup will be other selective options. Here we choose backup as scheduled. Full backup and archive log backup must be checked and other strategies can be used as per your demand. You can schedule each type of backup to run on a daily, weekly, or monthly basis. It's recommended to combine weekly full backup with daily archive log backup and incremental backup for high data availability. Speed Controller will let you set up the speed of backup job to avoid using too much bandwidth in production environment. Click Add Policy and then you can configure the max speed for database backup job. Select as scheduled or permanent will let you configure the max speed in specific periods or as a fixed number. In Data Storage Policy, you can enable data deduplication and data compression to reduce the size of backup file to save backup storage. In Retention Policy, there are two retention modes. If you select Number of Days, the backup system will save the latest backup files within the specific period. If you select Number of Restore Points, the system will save specific number of the latest restore points. Other outdated backup data will be automatically purged. To protect data security during data transmission, you can enable encrypted transmission in Transmission Strategy. In Advanced Strategy, you can set up to backup archive log in how many days, if you have checked archive log backup as one of the backup modes. Enable Delete Archive Log will delete archive log after backup. This will prevent data store being overused by redundant logs. Enable Oracle Compression will compress the backup with Oracle Internal Compression Technology. It's recommended to only use Vinchin's Data Compression, which we have enabled in General Strategy section, to prevent unnecessary computing resource occupation within the source database. Input a number in multi-thread will increase the threads during backup data transmission. You can maximally set 6 threads for this job. Once done, you can review the job details and submit the job. You can find that this job has been created in Monitor Center. That's all for today's video. Thank you for watching.